Hello friends and we are out again on this beautiful road of Western Guards going to camp near a special attraction and you will find so in a very close relation of our brand, our identity and the spirit that we are taking forward. So um, um, it's a plan for a night's camp, uh, maybe a visit also to a couple of nearby uh, dam water bodies and overall a good camp on Western Guards. Um, I will share the location, few of the locations for you know, uh, for, all, for all of us to know and I'll also share uh, what's the speciality about uh, the destination for this night. Stay tuned and uh, do watch the upcoming fresh content. These narrow roads of Western Ghat, the humid and a bit of hot climate of um, the summers, particularly so in uh, the Kokan region and maybe not so right uh, time and climate to camp but then we are going to try and explore um, if the four, four sides ventilation on our tent you know makes us uh, um, camp in a livable environment or then uh, it's altogether a bad idea otherwise climbing a little bit of guard section until now and uh, about a couple of kilometers down the line will be uh, reaching a plateau so uh, uh, the winds are a bit on the better side on the plateaus and it is it is also uh, facing the sea so uh, we expect that the ventilation on the plateau part of it would be a little bit better and with that um, uh, might be also the right place for us to camp so I'm, I'm waiting for another couple of kilometers and uh, then uh, we will be pro probably taking a detour to our, to our destination for today. Stay tuned. Hello guys and we are now quite close to our destination for today and I just wanted to show you this Fabulous of road. I mean, it's it's not a road as it's a trail that's uh, probably used by the local people to reach to uh, their orchards and um, the uh, mango cultivating lands. And I mean, it's already fabulous. Like um, you don't get so you know many trails which are like covered all in the um, just in trees around and uh, which are not demarcated per se, but yet fun to drive. So. Let me know how do you find this and stay tuned for the real thrill for you. And we are finally on the plateau and we have checked um, the exact location of the destination that we want to be at and it's um, a nearby uh, settlement that's known as Pashtewadi. So we are uh, just heading to that spot and uh, within about 10 minutes I am hoping to show you, unveil you the destination for today.
And finally, we are at our destination. So I have been keeping you um, a bit guessing as to where we are going to be today. And finally, we are here. Before I expose the location to you, just let me show you around how it is. And then you can make a few guesses. So this is what we have all got all around where we are at the moment parked and um, you can like quickly make out these are all um, the cattle hammocks or um, you can uh, say that uh, these are stables so the guals um, the people who um, take care of um, the cattle they um, make their cattle stay here so uh, you can see a lot of fodder around here some of the cultivational land and quite a many I guess about eight of um, the places where they can keep the cattle so I'll show one of those just for the sake of a bit of curiosity and this is how it is so you can see um, there's a place there to tie your cattle also feed it and basically protect it from but that's not the attraction the attraction is this can you see what's in front of us yes you're right this is another petroglyph so last time we had seen a petroglyph that's there at um, a place called Devi Asol this is resembling a lot to that but I guess a little bit smaller than that and one more interesting thing is um, if you note the center that's uh, somewhere here the center at uh, Devi Asol is having some kind of a um, entry or pit this is not having that one and but this is equally intriguing we have just you know cleaned a little bit and this location is also special because it is also having a special petroglyph and guess what it is of a bison now from where I am showing it to you you will not be able to see it what we are going to do is clean this one as well and uh, mark it with some kind of let's say legibility once we do it we are wanting to show you stay tuned
It's just evening and we are on the banks of another, yet another lake. This is known as Beni Lake and uh, because it's um, end of summer, rather about to be start of monsoon. So not a, a lot of water in the dam, but rather it's at its uh, lowest level possible. But uh, that's quite enough still and we are we are going to set up the tent um, have a walk around around in place check the surroundings and uh, yes then obviously cook have good food and then retire for the day Audu ji, kya chal raha hai? Bas cooking chal raha hai. Cooking Anyone chal can join us. Okay. Super. Cook, as well cooking, as well as for camping. What are you cooking today? Yeah, we cooking for biryani today. Biryani? Yeah. Mm, good, good. Aur isme kya pak raha hai? Ye to ande hai. Anda biryani? Yeah. Achha. That's... Badi achhi baat hai. Good. Aur ye kya? Aalu? Aalu. Anda aur aalu. Ji. Makes them. It's special dish for... Camping? Uh, camping, yeah. Okay. Super. And what is the patch? 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 What is <laughs> बिल्कुल जान लगा के पहला पहला कुकिंग ये किचनेट पे इनके हाथों में हो रहा है ओह थैंक यू थैंक यू मैम वेरी वेरी फॉर्चूनेट जो भी नया बनता है इनके हाथों ही उद्घाटन होता है उसका थैंक यू बॉस थैंक यू दीपक जी <laughs> टेंट भी ऐसे ही हुआ था जो हम डीआईवाई किए थे और अभी किचनेट हो रहा है तो टेंट वाज अ ग्रैंड सक्सेस सो आई एम ऑलरेडी कन्विंस्ड दैट किचनेट इज अ सक्सेस टू yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> and here is our dish for the night. The special camping biryani. Enjoy. Hello, buddy. We are in the tent. You all can't see anything because obviously it's dark. But um, we just want to have a quick review if um, it's okay for now. Um, the place being humid and a bit like hot during the day. How is it right now? So I feel that it's a bit of breeze and we're not sweating definitely. What do you say? Are we sweating? Yeah. How is no, it? No, no, no. Not. So I think it's, it's pretty good. Comfortable. I mean manageable. Not... Um, um, too hot, not too cold. All the four windows are open, and we are like cozy, I should say. Yeah. Yeah.
we have parked our vehicle there and now walking down the trail to check it if it's navigable um, it is supposed to be leading to a water body um, dam in western guards and um, we plan to have a dip in maybe spend a little bit of time and uh, yeah that's pretty it so once we check once we check we will uh, uh, get in there and have a dip stay tuned